It's very important to keep residents hydrated. Um, it's important to their mental and their physical well-being and in doing so it changes people's lives forever. So it is a factor that we need to keep really focused on. Dehydration side effect is not just with becoming ill, but when someone's not rehydrated in the attempt to walk, their chances of falling over are 50, 60 times higher than if they're not dehydrated. The doctor knew we were having this trial, thought it was wonderful, really wonderful. She noticed a marked difference in them, that they were brighter and more animated. One specific gentleman, it was very noted, that he had been in hospital and he had been quite poorly and obviously, you know, wasn't walking around in hospital, came to us and it was noted, through no one's fault, that he was dehydrated. Um, we did bloods to establish that. So we put him on a one-to-one -one regime with droplet. Honestly, within 40, 56 hours, he was up looking brighter, walking around, and his family actually came in and said, whatever you're giving him, we want some of it. With the droplet, it's got a great visual effect, and that visual effect is a reminder. And I believe passionately in it, that's why I'm, I'm saying this to you, because Apart from anything else, a flashing light's always something to look at. The little voice in the background is something to hear. It's almost like companionship, but it's doing a double thing because it's reminding them to drink. So we can be walking up and down the corridor, the light can be flashing. It will remind us, oops, I must give Mrs. So-and-so a drink. But if we walk up and down the corridor and we're very busy and task oriented and there's no flashing light, that little reminder's not there. A dehydrated person is more prone to chest infections, urinary tract infections, fractures, all sorts of things. So by rehydrating them, you're massively cutting costs here for a minimal input there. I would always advocate Droplet because of the huge results we've had and therefore I'm very proud to be an ambassador for it. Mm -hmm.